And as we're looking at Arrowhead Stadium, you can still see a lot of the cars that are out there in the parking lot, but I-70 fairly unaffected even on a Friday night during rush hour. I know I'm like stomping on Johnny Rowland's traffic reporting, but uh, right now it's looking pretty good out there with mostly dry skies. And isn't it nice to see some sun? 54 degrees, about normal. Humidity low, so it's comfortable out there, but that means it will probably drop quite a bit later on tonight. Not much of a wind chill, obviously, because it's mild, but also because the winds are only about three miles an hour. 56 in St. Joseph, 53 in Trenton, Lawrence 56, Butler 54, out toward Clinton 54 as well, Sedalia 52 degrees. Going to go out west to show you our next change. So we do have some fairly nice weather for your entire weekend, although we're going to see thicker clouds from this that's moving on shore. I want to give you your first alert to Monday and Tuesday. That's when we're going to see some rain chances on the increase, and some of the rain could be a big amount once again, and already the ground is pretty saturated, so we could even see a little bit of flooding as well. Evening forecast, really not looking that bad. Enjoy the sunshine for the next hour or so by 6 o'clock. 50 degrees on the nose. Bring out the jackets by later on, like 9 p.m. will be down to 43 and continuing to cool down pretty quickly. Midnight temperature, 37 degrees, but going even farther than that. As a matter of fact, tomorrow morning's low, I think, will be about 31 degrees, upper 20s to near 30 for most of us. But look at what's happening to the wind arrows. Instead of being from the northeast, instead of being variable, we're going to go southeast, and that's what's going to heat us up during the daytime hours. Your 12 hour forecast will start near freezing, get up to about 46 degrees by late morning, early afternoon in the 50s, almost climbing to 60 degrees by the afternoon hours. Here's a look at what we have in the northern tier. Plattsburgh, 60 degrees for a high. Tarkio, 62. Leavenworth, you'll start to climb out of the 50s and go out at 60 degrees in the afternoon. Richmond, 58. Higginsville, 59 degrees. And then farther south, even the southern portion of our viewing region, all in the 60s with plenty of sunshine. Obviously, no rain. Looking pretty nice for the next few. But then there's some changes in the nine-day forecast. What that's going to mean is that chance of rain that will be moving through on Monday and Tuesday. But the temperatures stay very close to 60 degrees, normal high, 56. So for the first day of spring, first weekend of spring, and as we start the next work week, feeling like spring with a few showers and thunderstorms. Wednesday and Thursday calming back down, upper 50s for temperatures, but then right back into the 60s for Friday, Saturday, and even on Sunday as well with partly cloudy skies returning.